Hey, hey, what's up, everybody, man? You already know. It's your boy, Cologne King, Sam, Sam, Sam. Not seven, Sam. Man, so check this out, man. I know um, I told y'all I was going to get black tie. Well, I did get black tie. I, I mean, y'all saw the first video. And I said I was going to do a review. All right, so my first impression when I smelled it, I ain't even going to lie. You know what I'm saying? I got kicked to y'all straight. I was like, what in the world is going on here, man? It was the oddest. It didn't smell bad. It just was something I never smelled before. It was it was different. You know what I'm saying? It was different from office date, unisex, which smells, you know, different to me. Uh, unisex smell different from date to me. But anyway, man, it, I was like, man, what in the world is going on? So I sprayed that bad boy on my hand. You know, I accidentally sprayed too close and I got that um citrus burst. It was like lemony. You can smell some orange, but it was like... It was very sharp, man. It um, kind of remind me of that citrus in a uh, CJ Black cologne. I don't know if y'all ever smell that, but um, it was very concentrated. You know what I'm saying? The quality of the smell was good, but then like I say, about 15 seconds later, man, let I guess what he said, the Gayak wood that stroke started to come out, man. It was strong, strong, and it basically it was like leveled out with the with the citrus. So now you're getting citrus and you're getting the Gayak wood, and this Gayak wood. I don't know. Once again, I don't know if it's the concentration. It was so potent, man. You know that it, it almost smelled like it was leathery, smoky, smokish, but also had like the, a weird twist to it. Almost like, um, like you hear when, like it's medicinal in a way, you know what I'm saying? It, it is like, if you smell Robitussin or if you taste Robitussin, it don't smell like that. Now don't get me wrong, but that same vibe is like, it smells woody or smoky, but it's like so concentrated in them it's almost like in a medicinal way you know what i'm saying and that kind of rolled out and you know that joker was smelling up the room and i would walk through the house and my wife was like what is that you know and i, I said black tie she was mad because i bought the stuff anyway so she ain't had nothing good she's like oh, i don't like that i like you know give it a chance or whatnot it was it was just booming man so after a while i like i was like you know what maybe i sprayed it too too close to my skin because it did come out like a puddle and it like ran down my hand so I washed that joker off. I sprayed it on unisex. I like unisex. My wife liked unisex. Um, I sprayed it. Um, like I said, I washed it off. Man, that joker was still coming through. It was still coming through. Here the bottle right here. I caught a bundle. You know, uh, a bundle. I got this in unisex um, for two ninety nine. So basically, I paid one fifty for it. That ain't bad. All right. So back to the story. So then I was like, you know, it, it was different. It's challenging. It was nothing I was used to. You know, so I had it like I like man, I got given another well. You know what I'm saying? It's something different. Like you, you're not gonna find anything on the market that smells like this. So anyway, I sprayed it. The next day, I sprayed two sprays on my neck, small sprays. I don't never push the atomizer all the way down. Two small sprays, cabin, cabin. And I basically, you know, I was doing some work. I had to plug, put a plug in my tie. It had a slow leak out. You know. In, in the car outside or whatnot so i'm outside and you can just cast whiffs every time you move my kids smelled it when i went in the house my wife smelled it and basically like three or four hours later that joker was still pushing but it was different from the, the my first um spray my initial spray you know you remember when i told y'all that i sprayed it on my hand right the day before and it was kind of balanced it was it was it was subtle you still got that weird that smokiness or whatever from that guy it was but it was it was more toned down and it was bearable at first it was too strong for me but it was bearable or whatnot so you know i'm walking around i'm like okay i'm kind of feeling this i can get used to it you know what i'm saying it's not like anything i have in my collection but i'm like i can get used to this you know but then that joker dried down now when it dried down it did kind of remind me of that dry down with date now date is my absolute favorite y'all can't tell me nothing about date y'all can hate on date date is it date make me want to kiss the bottle you know what i'm saying but anyway um it, it was reminiscent to date but it wasn't exactly like date and you still had that guy egg wood and you still had the the fruity the, the fruits coming through that was in the opening right so i'm like okay cool you know so i stepped out you know i ran into a female i know or whatnot and before she even said hey now this like be honest with you this like four hours later i did I, not even full sprays you know i can catch light wheels but i didn't know that that joke was projecting out like that so you know she was like three feet away from me when i saw her, and before she even said hey she was like what you got on tom ford 
I'm like, no, I ain't got no Tom Ford on. She's like, you don't know who, you don't know about that Tom Ford. I'm like, I'm the Cologne King. I know about Tom Ford. You know, and I started naming some of the scents. She was like, yeah, they, um, you know, it's, it's almost smell like some Tom Ford hair. I was like, not to me, but you know, that's her opinion. But then she goes, I said, how it smell? Do it smell strong? Like, what's your opinion? She's like, man, that smell good. That smell sexy right there. So I'm like, all right, cool. You know what I'm saying? And we was in the same facility or whatnot. So as I'm moving, every time I came by, she was like, oh, I still can smell it. That smells good. You know, and I'm like, you know, appreciate it. She complimented me like four times. No lie. Four times. It's getting dark. That's why y'all see, uh, you know, the, the car getting dark or whatnot. But it's complimenting me like four times, man. I was like, dang, ladies like this stuff like that, you know. And I and then when it dried down again, you know, she complimented me again. She it, every time I walked by, I was leaving the trail, and it's hours and hours and hours later, and I barely even sprayed it. This thing has beast mode performance, man. So, do I love it? I I wouldn't say I love it, but I like it. You feel me? Is 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 good? I wouldn't pay the price he asked for, but like one twenty five, one fifty, that's a good steal. You know, I'm not even a steal. It, it's all right. It's decent. You know what I'm saying? But um that that uh Gayek wood is very different you know what i'm saying if y'all know what that means it's different um it's balanced though when it dries down it get real sexy when it dries down i like the dry down the dry down is my favorite of the uh, um the top is is strong the mid is kind of like that Gayek wood it's kind of potent but that dry down man when that joker settle man you start moving man you get that you get that base. Well, I don't know. Patchouli got a little sweetness. I guess that the cardamom, uh, that's in it, man. But that joker, it, it smells good when it in the dry down. But like I say, man, ladies love this stuff, man. You know, they love it more than I do. But um, I just told y'all about that one, you know, situation with the female. But she just kept complimenting it, complimenting it, complimenting it, complimenting it. And she said it smells great. So, Jeremy, I don't know how you do it. You pulled it off again. Like you said, it's a compliment magnet. The, the ladies like it well they love it you know i like it it's different like i said date for men is my baby unisex eh, you know that's slightly behind date office that's pretty good but you uni, uh date is my baby man so that's what that's it with black tie y'all you know what i'm saying it's different it's challenging everybody can't pull this off i'm gonna let you know that right now everybody can't pull this off everybody's not gonna like it because it's strange it's, it's mysterious it's like you can't figure it out it denotes like stuff you never, you know, you never smelt this before. So you, it takes some getting used to. But once you spread and you appreciate the fragrance for what it is and what it's trying to pull off, you'll start to like it a little better. So once again, I don't love it, but I like it. And, uh, but I love that dry down. And, um, the ladies like it. So I guess that's what he was aiming for. They like it. They will compliment you. It's strong enough to, to, let me tell y'all this. Remember I tell y'all sprayed on two sprays? That was yesterday. I woke up in the morning, man. I got up and I, you know how you get up and you pause. Man, the scent still hit me, bro. That's how this thing performs. So I got to give them on that. I hate a fragrance that smell good but don't last. I hate it. I hate it with all my heart. So, Jeremy, at least you, you know what I'm saying, you put enough into it, you know, to get it to last on some people like me. Because I got, my my skin is like a sponge. It'll drink some, some, some fragrances up. So I like that. And it smells nice. And like I say, all his fragrances last, man. And that's why I rock with Jeremy. You know what I'm saying? I don't care if it smells like something else that's out there. I need something that smell good and last long. And he pulled that off. So to me, it's, it's good, man. You know, find it on a, at a good deal, man. And that's it. But this your boy, Cologne King. I ain't really have much to say. Because uh, how they say it? I don't even know how they say it. But uh, this your boy, I'm out, man. Peace.